Prince Harry and Meghan Markle set for first joint royal visit. Prince Harry and his bride-to-be Meghan Markle are due to visit a World AIDS Day charity fair later in the couple's first joint official public engagement. The world's media are likely to join the couple, who announced their engagement on Monday, on their trip to Nottingham. The morning will be spent at the fair, hosted by the Terence Higgins Trust. The couple, who are due to marry at Windsor Castle in May, will then meet here at teacher at a nearby school. Prince Harry has spent time in Nottingham both publicly and privately since he first met young people there in 2013 when he was exploring issues around youth violence. A year later, he established the Full Effect program, which aims to stop youth violence in the city. At Nottingham Academy, the couple will watch a hip hop era and meet students. His communications secretary, Jason Luff, said the prince was looking forward to introducing Liz Markle to a community that had become very special to him. He said Liz Markle could not wait to meet people she had heard so much about. The pair will also visit the fair to mark World AIDS Day, a cause that was supported by Prince Harry's mother, Princess Diana. On Tuesday, it emerged that Ms. Markle, an actress who until then had been a UN women's advocate and worked for World Vision, was to start royal life with a clean slate. Mr. Nuff said she planned to focus her attention on the UK and Commonwealth. This is the country that's going to be her home now and that means travelling around, getting to know the towns and cities and smaller communities, he said. She will also become the fourth patron of the Royal Foundation of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Harry. The foundation is behind Prince Harry's Invictus Games, the Paralympic-style competition for injured servicemen and women and veterans, and also the mental health charity Heads Together.